Okay guys, so if you have clicked on this video, you want to learn how to clean prawns. Now, you know, this is something quite close to my heart because when I go out to eat and I'll order some prawns, pick it up and see that it's not cleaned, it gives me anxiety, bro. Like it's not a nice feeling. No one wants to see the vein going down the back and you know, you just want clean prawns. So I'm here to teach you guys how to clean prawns. Now don't come for me. Everyone is different. Everyone does their thing different. You feel me? This is how I do mine. Okay? So follow along. The ingredients, everything you're going to need will be in the description down below. So let's get started and clean some prawns. Okay, so now I'm putting my gloves on because we are going to de-vein and clean some Jumbo King prawns. Okay, so again, follow along to make the full recipe of what I'm going to cook. Head to the playlist on my page and you will see. So what I have here, I have two bowls. So I have one bowl that has in the prawns in some cold water and then I've just got an empty bowl here. And then what I also have is some lemon juice just to wash them with and a small knife to devein them with. So as we can see, we've got, these aren't very jumbo. They say jumbo on the packet, but I mean, yeah, prawns ain't good again. You feel me? So we're going to run with these. But yeah, you can do this to any raw prawns, cooked prawns as well, actually, because some of them, they don't clean all of them. But what you want to do is you'll need to cut along the back and along the inside. So I'm going to show you the inside first. And you just take the knife and run it down the middle like so. So you just run it down here like this just to make a small incision. Hopefully you guys can see and there's not too much light. But then what you do, you take your knife and you pull underneath to pull out the vein like so. You probably didn't see that. But you will need to do it at the top and at the bottom. And then you should have a clean prawn. But put some cold water in that bowl so that basically once you finish cleaning your prawn you can put that into the bowl and also just give your hands a little rinse because you don't want the mess to stay because we're still going to we're still going to wash the prawns again okay so as you could see what I did just then I just took the knife and just sliced it down the back and that's so one you can check for veins there as well and if not and it's all good then you're fine and then you just put it in the bowl okay and then also when you're cooking this will kind of like open up a bit it looks a lot more pleasing so yeah if I show you again hopefully you'll be able to see better this time so you get your prawn run the knife along the middle like that where you've cut, just take your knife gently underneath and pull out the vein. Now what some people do, they also use a toothpick. Me, I can't be bothered. I'll just take the knife, do that and take it off. And then, there you go, gone again. And then just remember to slice along the back, not all the way down, just a little slit so that you can make sure, look like there, there might be another little vein, you wanna clean that out, like so, okay? And then you just take your knife, pull it out, Deveined prawn. Simple, simple, simple. And then just again, cut it down the back. 
like that, check for any more means and then you're good to go. So if you don't feel totally comfortable using a knife like this, you know, have a friend around, family member to do it with so that you can feel more comfortable, more safe and just make sure that you're super careful, okay? Because when you're cleaning any type of meat and using a knife, you've just got to make sure you do it properly. And this is a disclaimer for anyone that doesn't do it this way and is like, oh, this isn't safe. This has been safe for me. I've never cut myself before. And yeah, I'm just sharing it with you guys. So it's totally up to you whether you use this method or not. Just make sure that you're very careful whilst using the knife. Okay, so this is now our dirty water with all the stuff that we don't want. So we're gonna wash our hands and take that away. Now that our hands are washed, We've got our prawns here, but they still need a wash after they've been cleaned. So I'm just going to get some lemon juice. I'm going to be very generous. Don't feel like it's too much. I probably put about five tablespoons in there. And then you just want to mix it in. Make sure that all those veins that you've pulled out have fully come out. Wash them in your lemony water like this, and then we're going to give them a rinse. And then you have your cleaned prawns. Literally, as you can see, there is no more veins, just the meat. And it's a little bit bright, guys. I might have to turn off the light. You can probably see it a little bit better now, but that's the prawns cleaned. You see it? No veins, no nothing. So now you can just begin to season these up for whatever you want. So that is how you clean and de-vein your shrimp or prawns.